Bro, you think you're funny? I don't appreciate fake pranks. You know what? This is a freaking fake! Hey guys, what's up? It's Kyle from 10 Notes and Two, and I'm here with a blaze of men. Hey guys, check um, out my channel. <laughs> Link in description. Oh my god. All right, well we're at the, my house for the first time. We haven't done a video here yet, so we decided we we're gonna do this one today. Um, today is gonna be a different video. Uh, we are exposing one of our friend. Uh, what's this? Yeah. Final Touch AR. Final Touch AR. <laughs> Disclaimer though, we don't hate him. He's one of our friends, like yeah. not, I mean like friend. Like, like in like, real life. In real life, he's one of our friends, but um he did a couple of fake pranks and we thought it was necessary to yeah. expose we're, him. We're just gonna expose. You know, yeah. on my channel, I usually expose Kyle, but yeah. that's not real exposing. This time <laughs> we're we're kinda being a little more real. Yeah, it's gonna be like it's gonna be actual exposing like Syndicate and T Martin and everything. Yeah, so he made two well fake pranks. The bomb prank and also the, the drive through prank. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So first we're gonna go with the all right, here. Let's watch this little clip right here, and then you, we then we'll talk about it afterwards. Run. Okay. So as you can see in this clip, these two trucks drove by really, really slowly. Granted, that looks like a neighborhood. The trucks were going five miles an hour, <laughs> and their windows were open. They were driving really close to the curb. And like, if I saw like somebody with a bag like that, I'd be like, step on the gas, goodbye. Yeah. But I mean, he threw it in. Okay, so one, how do they get the bag back every time? That doesn't make yeah, any sense like to me. I'm sure they would have had to like, like go back and be like, oh, yeah. this is a prank. I mean, but as you can see in the one, the first or second one, I can't remember which one it was, but the bag Ooh. fell out of the truck and it looked like that was on purpose. Like right yeah. when he got out of the truck, he tossed it out. Like, um, and then. Hit that like how would you not see the cameraman behind you and then That's you know true. Abe when he was sitting behind the um the little box or whatever it was so that was that and then a couple other things um uh you're gonna watch this next clip where there's a couple of people he throws a bag at and we'll talk about this in a little bit. <laughs> the types of people in school and those people appear to be the people that are in his prank yeah I know and it looks like the, the people that were in that video look like they were set up to be in this prank we reviewed this whole the the bomb prank now we're gonna review the drive-thru prank so watch a little bit of it and then we'll talk about it I didn't I didn't ask for that <laughs> I didn't ask for that it was an ice caramel latte with whipped cream shot. I got my mango, oh, but I also want with whipped cream. Yeah, whipped cream. I'm sorry. So as you can see there, the cashier or the window worker looked like she was enjoying it. Like if I was a window worker and someone slapped something out of my hand, I'd be like, get the... <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't give him a new one. Like she was about to give him a new one. Yeah, I'd give him a new one. Get out of here. <laughs> Like, the, and I think that's his brother. Or, yeah, um, it's his brother. It's uh, the driver brother. of the car was his brother. It looked like he was like, that was scripted and he like, he knew what he was about to say next. Yeah. Like when you're doing a prank like that, you don't really script it. You just kind of go with it. And what happens, happens, you know? And what he did was like, he was like, I wanted my mango, I wanted this and that. And they would have known that. Like McDonald's messes something up. Like yeah. I always get like pickles if I don't want pickles, but you don't mess an entire smoothie up and then get slap it out of their hand and then get a new one. That doesn't happen. But it, it wasn't even messed up in the first place that much because usually they give you whipped cream by default. But he yeah. said he wanted whipped cream on it and that's why he slapped it. Yeah. So but that makes no sense because they always give you whipped cream. Exactly. Even if you don't ask. Exactly. It's like the what was it? The McCafe. They always give you whipped cream. So that was the two pranks he did, and um, that might be it for today. We all, we're gonna. This is not any hate towards Abe. No. This is just exposing the pranks. Yeah, we're much. just exposing him. We <laughs> really don't hate him at all. He's our friend, so. So, go check out a Blaze Man channel. I'll leave his link in the description, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. See you guys. <laughs> Are we even gonna get that part in? Huh?